Hi everyone, it's Mike, and in this video I'm going to show you how to use the new session players in Logic Pro 11 when making a song. So let's select Default Patch underneath Software Instrument and then choose Create. Let's record in a melody. Now I'm going to quantize the timing. And that has corrected any timing errors. Now let's go to Track, Global Tracks, Show Chord Track. So let's right click on the chord track and select Create Chord. Let's drag this chord to the start of the melody region. Now let's shorten this chord and create a new chord to match the melody. So this chord is a G major, so let's double click on the chord and select the root note as G and make sure major is selected. The next chord is an F major. I'm pressing Alt on the keyboard and dragging the chord to copy it. Double click the chord, choose F as the root note, and make sure major is selected. We're back to a C chord, so I'm just gonna Alt and drag the C. Next, it's an A minor, so I'm gonna Alt and copy the chord, double click, Select A and make sure minor is selected. Now we've created all the chords, I can just copy the rest to fill in the gaps. Now we have all the chords, when I insert the bass session player, it's going to follow those chords. I'm also going to draw a box around all the chords, right click and choose group chords so I can move that group of chords easily. Now it's time to add the bass, let's go to track, new session player SI track. Bass player is already selected so I'm going to press create. Let's move this bass region so it's underneath the melody. When we press play, the bass player should follow the chords that we've set. I really like those new slide sounds in the bass part. Really cool. Now let's add a drummer to this track. Let's go to Track, New Session Player SI Track. Select Drummer and press Create. Let's move this new drum region underneath the rest of our regions. A nice contemporary trap, let's also try an acoustic style. Let's click on trap and change type to acoustic drummer. I'm gonna try pop songwriter. I'm just going to extend the drum region slightly so it ends on a drum note. 
Now I'm going to try using one of the keyboard player session instruments to replace my original keyboard playing. So it's track, new session player SI track, and let's choose keyboard player. We'll move it along to match, I'll mute my original playing, and let's have a listen. Puts me to shame. We can also choose a different sound on the left hand side to match the original electric piano. I'll choose Deluxe Modern. We can also choose different presets for the melody. There's Calm and Steady. I can't really hear that one. What about Keep Moving? Let's try sliding up the intensity. We can also change the bass melody. Let's try Unwritten Path. Cool, so there we go. That's how to use the new session players in Logic Pro 11. I hope you found this video useful. Remember to subscribe, let me know what you think in the comments, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.